Hi guys and welcome back to Fishing Sim World Pro Tour. So the next event is the White Oak Open. It's at Lake Miller and it's bass fishing. For now, I'll just start off with the Ocean Breeze Lure since we're only actually going to use one rod. Greetings everybody and welcome to the next event on the tour. While the competitors are making their final checks over their tackle, let's take a So let's pretend I'm Sonny Crockett and let's do a bit of Miami Vice and we'll jump in the old speedboat. Just need to find a shallowish part of the water, right on the edge here, it's about 6 foot deep. Uh, this is 12, 10, it's a little bit deep. I'm going to do like a lot of trees overhanging, plenty of shade. Tell you what, let's go and find another one. Try on the other side. This is looking a bit more promising. Plenty of trees overhanging and the depth. Five foot. Looks pretty good. There was a lot of fish there as well, wasn't there? Yeah, we'll make this do. So we'll start off with the Ocean Breeze Lure, I think. So I've only wasted a whole minute. Yeah, I should have done this a little bit quicker, I think. Slightly indecisive there. So I've got the speed on at one. And at last, we're doing a bit of fishing. Remember to keep an eye on the sonar, make sure there's plenty of fish in the area, otherwise you're not going to catch much, and it seems pretty active at the moment, so it's looking good. Just need to get a bite now. They're doing very well at the moment, luckily the opposition, they haven't registered on the board either. But there's plenty of fish on the old sonar. I can see flying by. And right, we'll drop to second already. Five pounds. Somebody's on the board. Wow, have I picked the wrong spot here? The bass are being very shy today. Oh, plenty of fish being caught now. Yeah, the leaderboard's come alive. And at last we got one, and it's a perfect strike. Ooh, trying to get a bit worried there. Nearly three minutes in, not a sausage on the old scoreboard. This guy has really pulled on the new line. Yeah, a couple of times I was worried it was going to snap there. I do want to repeat of the last time we were bass fishing. We lost how many fish? Three or four, maybe? Whoa, again, I thought that was going to go. I may need to get a bigger line. I can't remember which line I've got at the moment. Is it a £10 one? May have to up it to 15 maybe. Yeah, this guy's really fighting it. Definitely starting to think bigger line. The only downside of that, the fish actually might spot it in the water. Finally, we managed to get the guy, and what sort of size is it? 10 pound 8 ounces, really nice start. That should put us top of the leaderboard. Currently, we need a good two pound in the lead. Let's get the rod back in the water. Need to get some more fish caught. I 
I've upped the line speed to two this time. Just when it was in one, I think it might have been a little bit too slow for the bass. So hopefully at two, it'll tempt them a little bit more. Yeah, Sonar's gone very quiet. Haven't seen anything for quite a while now. Come on, fishies, where you're at. Yeah, struck out that time. Let's recast, get it back in the water. I think I just say managed to keep that in the water. I was nearly on dry land there. And I just noticed a few fish there flew by on the sonar. At least there's still some fish active in this area. That's always a good sign for fishing. Luckily at the moment, the lack of fish is not hurting us too badly. We're still in the lead. 40 minutes to go. Come on, I'd like another fish. Nope, we struck out again. Um, what direction this time? Let's use the little motor. We'll quietly move the board just to a different location. All the time we're moving here, I'm keeping an eye on the sonar. A lot of fish just gone by here, so hopefully this spot might be a little bit better. And I've just noticed second spot could just hit the 10 pound mark, so unless we catch something soon, I think we're going to lose that lead. I've dropped the line speed back to one again. I just wasn't having much success at two. And there we go. Boom. Oh, it's a poor strike though. Hopefully you can still reel this guy in. He's definitely got some speed on him. I'm not envisaging it's a 12 pounder, that's for sure. Seem to be doing okay at the moment, not really stretching the line too much. Ooh, we're getting pretty high there. Actually, he looks a lot bigger on the line than what I thought. And now he's really stretching the line, yeah. He's fighting for all he's worth. Can we get him in? And we've just lost the lead as well, damn. Can't afford to lose this guy now. Oh, no disaster, just as I said that. Snap line, damn it. Right, let's get back in the water. We need to get some fish caught. Really want to win this event if we can. Going to leave the line speed at one again. And it's a bite straight away. This time, perfect strike, fantastic. This time, can we please catch him? No more snap lines. I may be being a tinge aggressive on that last one. I just really wanted to reel this guy in. The event's really surprising me. The scores are really low. I mean, nearly halfway through the event and what? Somebody's just had 11 pounds there. Oh, no, I don't believe it. We've lost another one. Right, let's try the other side, I think.
Hmm. Should I change the lure? I don't know. We're leaving an ocean breeze for now. Oh, crap. That's a bad cast. Come on, this time. Yeah, 95% that'll do. Just hitting the halfway point here. Yeah, 10 minutes in. £11.13 is the lead. We're only a few ounces behind them. So I think if we get, what, 20, £25 worth of fish, we should win the event. We've actually got to reel the damn things in. We keep losing them at the moment. Since we've lost the last two fish, and I remember the last time we were bass fishing, we did lose quite a lot of fish. Should up the line thickness, what do you guys think? Maybe put it up to 15, 20? Oh, will it reduce how many things I catch though? I don't know. It's a tough light to walk, isn't it? It's a proverbial desert over this side, isn't it? Yeah, nearly nine minutes left to go. We haven't caught anything for quite a while now. Yeah, the sonar's gone very quiet again. Oh, at last. Finally, a fish has come by. And another one. Please jump onto my line. Definitely plenty of fish on the sonar now. I'm not getting a bite, though. Oh, we've dropped a fourth spot now, yeah. Yes, we need to catch something. Get us back up that leaderboard. Uh, yeah, let's try the other side again. Get nothing on the other side there. And another minute ticks by. Oh, guys, I'm getting slightly worried now. <laughs> yeah, one fish and that is it. Is our luck finally run out? Looking at the leaderboard, I did guess 20 to 25. I'm thinking 20 pounds, that's going to do it. So we only need one more 10 pound bass and that'll get us the win. We've just got to catch the damn thing. No more snap lines. The ocean breeze lure, it's normally very reliable catching bass, but today I've either picked the wrong spot and just as I see that, we get a perfect strike. That's sod's law, that isn't it? You criticise it, tell them how bad it is, and then you can actually catch something. I think I'm going to have to be super patient here, I really can't afford to lose this one. Just let him out, let him out. Yeah, just got to try and wear him down. Ooh, crap, that line really been stretched there. And at last, we got a catch. This might be not bad. Eight pounds, maybe? Seven pound, eight ounces. That wasn't a bad guess. Oh, at last, that should put us back in the lead. And it does... We've got roughly a six pound lead and there's six minutes to go. We may be okay here. I would like one more fish if I could get it. Yeah, the lead wouldn't be so tight if I caught them other two fish, would it? Have we got a bite? Oh, it's a poor strike though. Yeah, really, you need to relax just a little bit. 
I am snatching at them. I want to get perfect strikes if I can. I'm pretty confident if we can reel this guy in, we should win the event. Even if he's just a five or a six pounder. It's such a low scoring event. Honestly, can't believe it. Normally the scores are a lot higher than this. Yes, we got him. I'm guessing seven pounder here. Six, seven pounder. Yeah, six pound ten. Good guess. That should get us the win now, guys. Ooh, we can relax just that a little bit now. Yeah, £12 lead, that should be more than enough. And apparently now I'm fishing on land. <laughs> yeah, I think that was a little bit too far. 80%, that should do it. Oh no, oh yes, it dropped in the water there. We've only got f just over four minutes left to go. I don't know if we'll get anything else. As I was casting there, I did notice just along the riverbank there, there were some reeds in the water. I think next time, make a mental note. Definitely try fishing around that sort of area. You got a bite. Yes, perfect strike this time. Yeah, I was a bit more relaxed on the old day. Right there. We've got three and a bit minutes to reel this guy in. For a lot of the time, it was touch and go on this event. If we can just reel this guy in, I think we'll get a pretty comfortable win. Oh, he's really stretching this line. Yeah, gotta be careful here. I don't want to lose him. Oh, no. Damn it. Oh, was I too aggressive there? I don't think I was. I'm starting to think this line, it's just not strong enough. That's three we've lost today. I think in the last event we lost, what, four or five maybe? So the bigger fish, probably the 10, 12 pounders. It's, it's getting harder to reel them in with this line. And truly, we get another bite this time. It's a poor strike, though. Right, we've got two minutes to reel this guy in. Oh, are you for real? Straight away, we've lost him. Yeah, I'm stick to death to this line now. Let's up that, I think. Yeah, we've got a £10 line. Let's put it to 15 I think, for sure. We'll put them all on 15 I think I'm happy with the rest of that box. And let's get back out there. So I've got no excuses this time. If it snaps anymore, it's my fault. And we've got a bite, and it's a perfect strike. It's unbelievable. The last five minutes, we had plenty of bites. The previous ten, I think we virtually had nothing. Right, he's stretching the line straight away. Hopefully this 15-pound line should be enough for him. Just got to take me time here. We've got well over a minute to reel him in. He is fighting it though. Oh, I thought I had him there. I was a touch aggressive. <laughs> yeah, I'm really playing with this new line. Makes you wonder what our scores would have been today. I mean, all the fish we've lost. We may be getting like 40 or 50 pounds even. We should win the event anyway, and we've actually got this guy already. I'm thinking eight to nine pounds. 
Seven pound fourteen. That's pretty close. Is that going to take us over thirty? It is thirty-two pound nine ounces. Wow, bit of a flattering scoreline. I don't think I played very well today, guys. Barring a miracle, we're not going to catch anything more. Down to the last ten seconds, anyway. We're definitely going to win. And that event done, guys. We managed to win on £32.9 ounces. Only caught four fish, though. Three on the ocean breeze and one on the old frog. Yeah, I don't think I had the greatest spot there, plus the old line problems. But who cares? It's a win. Another 100 points on the board. So if you've had fun today, please like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. And I'll see you next time for some more Fishing Sim World Pro Tour. Bye, guys.